You join us in the United Kingdom today, or Great Britain, as it's alternatively known. Well, it's certainly a great day today, as we welcome you to one of the crown jewels of British sports, a track of speed, history, and drama. It's Silverstone. It's the British Grand Prix. The 3.6 mile long Silverstone circuit is one of the longest of the season, with 18 corners in the current layout. With average lap speeds reaching around 145 miles per hour, it's also one of the quickest tracks of the year. Watch out for cars taking the right-handers of Abbey and of Cobbs flat out. Before we begin, let's take a quick look at the grid lineup for today's race. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position. And starting next to them is George Russell. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Sainz, Norris, Albon, Leclerc, Bottas, Joe, Verstappen, Gasly, Ocon, The Scientist, Hulkenberg, Magnussen, Perez, Sonoda, Oscar Piastri, Theo Porcher, Stroll, Sargent, De Vries and Jack Dewan. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. To see how the dry conditions could affect the lifespan of the tires. Safety car, no overtaking, reduce your pace. Keep your delta number positive as we form up. Return the position immediately or we're going to get penalised. There's no overtaking during the safety car period. Strategy complete. See these tyres through to the end now.
Oscar's coming in for his stop now. OK, clear. Use overtake, use overtake. Work, mate, that brings you up a place. got one lap of fuel remaining.
fantastic drive. That's just fantastic. Amazing. You deserve that race win. Well done, mate. It wasn't always plain sailing today, but it was a very important win nonetheless. Tell me, Ant, how do they manage to achieve this win? I think we'll chalk this one up to a deft touch on the brake pedal. That's allowed them to challenge down the inside into the braking zones, and ultimately, if you do that often enough, you end up winning the race. It was great to watch as well, though, wasn't it? Forget strategy, forget tyre management. Who doesn't love a good old-fashioned scrap? A show-stopping performance from the three drivers approaching the podium right now. It's been an interesting Grand Prix, that's for sure. The standings have changed. The scientist takes over the lead of the drivers' championship. Now let's discuss Ant. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? I have to give it to the scientist. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the constructors' championship. It was a tough race for our championship leaders, who lose ground at the top of the table. There was also a strong showing from the McLaren team today as they make their way up the standings. And with that, we wrap up another weekend of motorsport action. But with more races lined up, be sure to join us when we come back with more Formula One.